our crew arrives in a little over three hours and this is how the boat looks. Mm. Okay. These are my warm clothes because we've been spending some time in the tropic but that time is over so I'm gonna need all of this. Hello and welcome on board Polar Seal, where we are five days away from our big departure from Bonaire to the Azores. And until today, I was doing perfectly fine. The boat is in great condition, we've been working on it for two months, all the systems are fixed and upgraded or maintained. We're on schedule, um, but this morning, Ryan started the water maker without opening the water inlet and it led to a minor water explosion that we had to fix. And for a hot second, I thought that we had lost the water maker right before our departure. And that sort of triggered my departure nerves. Not to mention, it is currently 2 p.m. Our crew arrives in a little over three hours and this is how the boat looks. Mm. Okay. These are my warm clothes because we've been spending some time in the tropic, but that time is over, so I'm gonna need all of this. And this is her cabin. We've got some work to do. How's it going, Ryan? <laughs> no, it's going all right. We just have like a chore of little things to do before we go. Lots of little things and it adds up. So we take them on a little bit at a time. Obama behind me. I'm in chase. I put that drama behind me. I'm so sweet. So for the last few days that we are on the island, we have rented a car just so that it's convenient for us to run errands, do some provisioning, and uh, go pick up our crew at the airport. Yay! So one very important thing that we need to do before departing, we're going to be away at sea for about a month is to close all of our administration errands before we go. It's paying the bills, making sure that we have enough money on the bank account so that the bills can be paid. Uh, and it is also making sure that the visa application that our lawyer is putting on our behalf so that I can eventually enter the United States is closed. And so we have a bunch of papers that we needed to send to our lawyer Minneapolis and we really get to send those before we go to the Azores. Oh no. It's way more expensive than I thought it was gonna be. How much is it? 92 bucks. To keep our papers to the US. Yeah. Uh. Alright. Yeah. Okay, so we have sent our paperwork. We have dropped our gas bottle for it to be filled. So now we have another two hours before we need to go pick up Annette, our crew. And uh, the only thing I can think about right now is that I need to take a nap. <sighs> All right. Okay, we have half an hour until we are picking up Annette, and I think that I've nailed her cabin. Clean sheets, bed made, towel, extra sheets, sleeping mask, clean, clean, clean. Okay. Oui, oui. Unfortunately, this clean cabin comes at the expense of the rest of the boat. So now my dilemma is that I have to put all of this in this. Can you help me, Ryan? What do you need? Move in that? Yeah. Let's do it. Okay. Oh. So normally in this cabinet, I keep all of my towels and sheets and I keep all of my clothes in the Vibers, uh, but I don't want to disturb Annette every day while she's with us. So I decided to move the sheets and the towel to the Vibers and have my little wardrobe in there so that we're all comfortable. Don't need to uh, 
tramp on each other's privacy. Uh, oh, there is more. Okay, send them more, send them more. Uh, oh, it is so hot right now. I think it's looking really good. The V-Birth hasn't been that clean in a very, very long time. I think if you look like on that angle, it looks okay. It looks pretty good. You just have to stop here and definitely not look in our bedroom. I think we should make a plan that uh, when she arrives, you immediately go downstairs and you put yourself <laughs> like this I, to... Uh, I can do that. To hide, hide the truth. All right, let's go pick up Annette. Pick. Yeah, it's uh, rush hour. Oh man, Ryan, those traffic jams on the island, they're terrible. These are bad. They're, it's bad really tonight. bad, really bad. Oh, I think I see her. Oh, oh yeah, I totally do. Hello! Hello. Welcome to Bonaire! How are you? Yeah, good. I just need to figure out what to think. Are we all going? Yeah, we're all going. We're all going. <laughs> oh my god. Here, how about we scoot back a little bit and we try to have the bags a little farther I think, I think back. We're good. It's just Here. Around there right. we go. There we go. Those bags are nice. Mm -hmm. All right. We made it! Yay! High five! Yes. Welcome on board! Oh, so the pole is still. <laughs> she oh, is right. most likely a lot smaller than you imagine. The tour is gonna be... Uh, two minutes. Two minutes? Yeah. Oi, 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 Okay, it's okay, you can come now. Uh, yeah? Okay. Yes. Lauren, like, you need to spread your wings a little bit. Yes, so welcome like to the that. polar seal. Thank you. It's You're so clean and tidy, isn't it? It is beautiful in yeah. here. <laughs> you just can't see behind me. <laughs> <laughs> that's perfect. Yeah. <laughs> Look at all the snacks. <laughs> yeah, no, that's for the ditch bag actually. One so, uh, Annette, this is it. Voila. This is perfect. <laughs> this is... <laughs> They're good to watch. Mm. Yeah. Look at how clear. Look at all the fish there. It's like uh, eating in an aquarium. We've been so spoiled by the Caribbean. And now... Do you already know what you'd like to drink? Uh, I will start with a blue colada. You should have that too. It's like a piña colada but with a blue curacao. Oh, okay. Why well, you like it so much? Because it's a little uh, uh, yeah, it's nostalgic a little, or how you, you say know, it. Cheers. I had a little too much. Cheers. Um, <laughs> cheers. Mm. Oh, sweaters! Oh, wow. That's cool. Yes, Team Catamaran Supply! That's cool. One for you. Thank oh, you. Oh, that is amazing. You have one, I hope. Yes, I have one oh as well. My God. We're, we're not going to be we're not going to be Team Polar Seal on this passage. We're going to be Team uh, Team <laughs> Catamaran Supply. We shall uh, put things away tomorrow exactly because like tomorrow yeah. the boat's going to be a mess because we're going to take the provisions in and redo the lockers. So. Okay. Yeah, so that will be fun. So the question is, how much are we going to poop across the Atlantic? Um, are we going to poop that much? Or are we going to poop uh, that much? What do you think, Annette? I mean, I vote value pack, but I'll change the two of the... I think that the problem with the value pack is uh, where we're going to store it.